Okay, hey guys. Uh, sorry for the semi-poor quality of this video. I can't find my good camera. But uh, here you can see I have my new Nexus 7 from Google, made by Asus. Oh, I gotta unlock it with my face. Oh no, I don't. Here we go. Um, so there, that's, that's the Nexus 7. Um, and I've seen a lot of products on the internet, as far as cases and all kinds of stuff, that are supposed to waterproof smartphones, and I haven't seen any out for the Nexus 7 yet, but I'm sure there will be some soon. But those things cost anywhere from 15 to to $100, and I'm here to show you guys today the cheap, almost free way of doing it. So you'll see what I have here is a Ziploc bag and I'm doing this all one-handed because I'm recording this on my Android phone. There we go. And what I'm going to do is flip the bag around so the logo's not in the way. So I'm going to put the Nexus 7 into the Ziploc bag button side first. There's that, right? And then give me just a second. I'm going to suck the air out of this bag. You just seal the bag partially and then suck the air out through the little piece you have and then seal it up the rest of the way. And that'll make it tight on the screen. And this will affect the resolution of the screen a little bit while it's in there. It just doesn't look as good, but it's still, it's still perfectly usable. And obviously you can't charge it while it's in the bag, but a lot of those waterproof cases you get are one-time use only, and they have a sticker or something that you put on the back. And once you take it off, you can't put it back on, and so you also can't charge the device in those. So give me a second, I'm going to suck the air out of this bag, and then we're going to drown this next. Okay, seven. so I'm back, right. and I have sucked the air out of the bag, and you can see that... The tablet is still perfectly usable. Um, let me see. I'll open up Chrome. It's a G O O G L E. Google.com. There we go. Perfectly navigable. Sure, Google. You know my location anyway. But uh, tablet's perfectly usable. I'll open up this Popular Science. You can still read magazines, pinch and zoom, all that while it's in the bag. Uh, you can still hear perfectly fine. Tilt it there. There we go. Let this load. I guess it's streaming off Google Play. This is the Transformers movie that came with the, whoops, that's something I keep doing is, hitting the power button when I mean to turn up the volume. I don't know how well it's coming over the speaker on my phone here, but I can hear it perfectly clear. It doesn't sound like it's in a bag or anything. And now... Let's go back. You will notice that it can kind of slide around in your hand a little bit. And really, if you were going to use this all day, like maybe take it out on a boat or something, you could just... Oops. You could use like a little duct tape or scotch tape even and just kind of fold the bag up and kind of tape it down because you have all these edges that aren't used by the screen on this tablet and so yeah all right um i'm going to switch it over to the camera that is on the nexus 7 and we're actually going to test this and hopefully i won't drown my tablet okay now you can see 
on the screen the camera quality is reduced a little bit by the uh, bag but you're probably not going to be taking very many pictures since you only have a front facing camera um, I'm going to start recording and I'm going to drop the tablet in there and you're going to see how the world looks from under the water here we go so the tablet is like not usable while it's underwater. You can see I can't really do anything. But as soon as you pull it out again, it's perfectly fine. I don't even think that recorded because it was under the water. Here we go. Oh, it hit the home button again. Well, you can see I've submerged it and brought it back out a couple of times now. Some water on the outside of the bag, none inside. This will definitely protect against any kind of splashing or anything that you might get or an accidental drop into the bathtub. But I would not recommend going, say, diving with your tablet ever for any reason, regardless of what kind of watertight case you have on there. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and if you have any nice suggestions, be sure and make them, and have a good day.